Of our 450 approximately turbines installed in the UK, roughly 95% of them are with farmers. Farmers are, I think, early adopters. They see the benefits, the, the very quickly the benefits that can be derived from actually investing in, in green power. So they, as, as well as getting a check every month for, for the feed-in tariff for making the investment, they're seeing dramatic decreases in their cost of power. So it, it's, it's kind of a double-edged sword for them. They're, they're quite happy. The, the, the farming community are very cognizant of their cost structure so that for them to save a couple thousand pounds a year when they're dealing in basically a marginal business lots of times or a small margin business uh, it, it's a big thing so I guess the lesson that, that we would have learned or, or could be learned from other other uh, sectors of the economy is all relative to um, taking a longer term view of your energy cost th there's no reason to believe they're ever going to come down uh, certainly not in the UK, and to take 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 advantage of the fact that in the UK you've got extremely good wind, you've got a very strong support mechanism for uh, for for making an investment, and once again you you've got a um, uh, uh, how do I put this? You you've you've got a very strong uh, wind regime that that makes uh, that makes the UK probably the best place in the world, and, and you've got your high cost of power. Cost of power is not going down. Grid, grid connectivity is an issue. Uh, it's not such an issue with the turbines in our, in our size range, but as, as you get bigger, is, there's more capacity going into the grid. So, so the grids are constrained. They've got, and it's a, it's a, a capital investment cost for the grid operators. It's, it's a, very expensive to upgrade all the grids. Part of what small wind is about or medium wind is about is it's distributed energy. So our power tends to be consumed where it's, where it's generated. So within, within the small area of grid, that's where the power is actually used. So uh, it, once again, in terms of, of an investment and getting finance, more and more banks are now comfortable with our technology and just technology in general. So loans are easier to get. Uh, there, there's actually um, asset-based loans now where you don't have to put up your farm. So that the industry is maturing and with that comes uh, easier access to finance, things like that.